Hey everybody, yesterday NECA revealed their Matt Hooper figure from Jaws, so we're going to take a look at the figure and just kind of look at the possibility of what a complete figure line could look like from NECA. So stick around. <laughs> Please like, subscribe, and share. Please help. Welcome back, everybody. So last night, NECA revealed photos to their upcoming Matt Hooper figure from Jaws, their 8-inch retro cloth figure line. And here he is here. He comes with two different heads, like the Quint figure did. And he comes with this one, with this facial expression, and then he comes with this one here. And he comes with two different hats, one that's more like a winter cap, and then the other one that's kind of more of like, you know, like a beach hat kind of thing. And then he comes with his duffel bag, and he comes with two different styrofoam cups. One that you can have him holding as if he's drinking out of it, and one that he's crushed from the scene right here. Fans of Jaws knew the Matt Hooper figure was coming when NECA teased this picture right here because we knew it was this hat that Richard Dreyfuss wears in Jaws. And now we have photos of the actual figure wearing that hat and it looks great. It looks like Richard Dreyfuss from Jaws. It's equally as well sculpted as the Quint figure was and I look forward to putting him in my collection. I look forward to having him with the Quint figure. And like I said, he comes with the knit cap that he wears early on in the movie when we very first meet his character, when he's first introduced into the film. And yeah, you can have him wear that and have his duffel bag that he's carrying with him when he first meets Brody. But unfortunately, there is no Brody figure. You can leave the hat off of his head, and he doesn't look so Odd. At least, I don't think it looks bad. And here he is holding his styrofoam cup, which seems like the oddest thing for an action figure to come with, but he does have it in the movie. And there he is with Quint. Quint's crushing his beer can, he's crushing his styrofoam cup. What I really want to see in this figure line is Matt Hooper in his cage. I want to see him in his wetsuit. I'd like them to make the figure in the wetsuit and have it come with the cage like we see at the end of the movie. I really am looking forward to that and I think that they're going to do it. I just have a feeling it will be done. It's just a question of when. We already know what the box is going to look like for the Matt Hooper figure because here we have seen the Quint figure and the boxes will match for sure. And speaking of the Quint figure, let's look at him real quick just to make this video complete by looking at everything. This figure is still my favorite figure so far this year, although the Jason Part 7 figure is amazing and the Kessler Wolf I think is going to just take the top prize maybe. But this figure, amazing. And as we all know, there was a Brody figure. The Roy Scheider figure was coming out. He was announced when Quint was announced, but he was canceled, and I'm still hoping that something happens where they're able to produce this figure. I don't know why it was canceled, if it was his estate, his family wasn't happy with the likeness or something, or whatever the reason may be. I'm just really sad that this figure wasn't made. It's kind of hard for me to make the video knowing that, it, that it's not a complete set. This would have been awesome to have Roy Scheider from Jaws. I mean, he is the movie. I mean, besides the shark, it's, you know, it's Roy Scheider. And I, I, I'm hoping that somehow NECA gets the license and they're able to, to make that figure. And yeah, and then the figures will be complete. I mean, it would just be really great to see these guys together, to have all of them, all three of them sitting on your shelf together. I mean, these figures were not made in 1975, and it just would be great if NECA could make that happen. To finally give Jaws the figure line that it deserved way back then, that would be great. And of course, the shark is supposed to be coming. They've showed this picture, you guys. I've showed this many times in my other videos. He's coming at some point, and you'll have, hopefully, an announcement from NECA that will look something like this. I mean, 
we need the shark. The shark is the movie. I mean, of course I went on about Roy Scheider, but the shark is the star. And we want them to make Bruce the shark so Quint and him can have a beer together. No, we don't. We just want him to eat our Quint figure, that's all. And, you know, maybe attack Hooper in his cage. That would be fun. I think they could also make Ellen Brody. And how about Mayor Vaughan? I mean, I would buy those figures. And I think they should make the girl that gets eaten at the beginning of the movie that's on the movie poster. They should make a Chrissy Watkins figure. I mean, I'm serious. I can understand why they wouldn't make her. But the actress did have a costume before she went skinny dipping. I mean, you know, maybe they should consider making Chrissy. She deserves a figure and, you know, like I said, she's the girl on the movie poster with the shark. Come on. She could come with her severed arm. Or they could at least have Chrissy's arm come with the autopsy Hooper figure. I mean, you know, at least you get some kind of Chrissy. And what about the guy in the boat? I'd like to see a figure of him too. Let's do all of the victims. And you gotta do Alex Kittner on his little yellow raft. I mean, come on, you gotta do all of them. You gotta do Chrissy, the guy in the boat, Alex Kittner getting eaten here and you want his little yellow raft. And of course we want Pipette. That's right, NECA, we want Pipette too. I think the Jaws figure should come with Pipette. And we want Ben Gardner, or at least his head. I mean, maybe scuba diving Cooper can come with the head or something. I don't know. Hey, and maybe a Steven Spielberg figure. But if you guys can't wait to get the NECA three foot long Bruce the Shark figure so it can eat your Quint figure, you can always go right now and get the Toonie Terrors version that's in the stores right now. So go get that. And Quint's still available. Go get him. And I'm going to close the video showing the Matt Hooper figure again, some of these photos. It's another incredible sculpt from NECA. They just get better and better. I cannot wait for this figure. I am truly excited. Well, that's it for this video. Please like and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Bye. He's completely mad. Toys in the attic he has. Uh. Completely mad.